I know this is unexpected, but a day or two ago, um, someone had asked me a question about how they would know they were ready. And since then, um, the Holy Spirit has brought that question to mind or even put it in conversation. So I was told that there's one more message. This is one he's calling God's work, message 279. My children, it is very true that I am on my way to get you and bring you home. I see there are several people that are not sure if they are ready. There are a few that are not sure they will be found worthy to be called up in the rapture because they have heard that they there will be many that think they are Christians, even preachers that will be left behind. It is not it really is not hard to know. As if you are doing my work for your glory, you are not ready. As you are not within me, but are within your own pride. Even if you say you believe and love me, and you work and say you love me, and you work many miracles in my name, if I am not doing the work in you and through you, then it is done of your own strength and not of mine. My word does not return void, and yes, miracles will happen, as my words are true, and there is power in my name. But if I have not anointed you, then well, what more can I say except go away from me, as I do not know you? You know there is a difference between love and being in love. There is also a difference between my being Lord and being Lord of your life. You may confess that you know me with your mouth, but if I am not working in you and through you, then you are not ready. If I do not, if I do work in you and am living in you, then you and you truly love me with all your heart, mind, and soul. If my Holy Spirit is in you and I live in you, then you will be made spotless and will be ready to come home when I call. People of the world, I am coming, and I am coming now. Come to me now. Repent and be healed, and be made ready as your redemption draws closer every moment. You have been warned, you have been told, and your heart knows this is true. As I have spoken to every one of you in your spirit, listen to my call, listen to my words, and let me in. Let me in now. There are truly are only moments before I will be seen and the trumpet will blow as my angels and I are on the way on our way my will is that none perish so please swallow your pride and let me work in you and through you right now Yahshua Hamashiach and then he gave me first John four sixteen, and so we know and rely on the love of God the love God has for us God is love. Whoever lives in love lives in God and God in them. Guys, we will be going home very soon. Please answer his call and open the door to your heart so he can make you cleaner than clean and whiter than white. Only he can make you ready. It is not something we can do for ourselves. Hopefully we'll be seeing each other very soon. Until then, take care and God bless.